I'm at uh, it's Wednesday. I hope that you're having a great day and don't worry Dean gets a lot better because Dean is awesome and you'll learn to love him and cry over him because Dean's just a good guy. Don't worry. But today I am joined by Marie and we're gonna review Tiffio's just for you, not for anyone else. Cecilia, if you're watching this, this isn't for you, Cecilia. Because you're a bully. That. Cecilia is a bully. So what did you think of Tiffio's? I liked Tiffio's a lot. I did. I love Tiffio's. We saw it the day it came out, and then I saw it again on Monday, and I saw it with Din. I think we all cried. You cried. I yeah. cried. We had a good... The entire mo movie theater cried. Yeah. If, if they didn't cry, it was kind of disappointing. But I think that's the whole point that the movie's going for, is to make you cry. That's... Really <laughs> depressing. <laughs> but this movie's depressing. <laughs> but it's good. It's such good. In it, it had the text message things. <gasps> the text it. message things were so good. The text good. message cute thing. They were th the, 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 the text message things were so cute. I they reminded me of Sherlock a lot, mm -hmm, and I too. liked the emails, and I liked how it all came together because you could tell that it was like from Hazel's point of view. As Marie comes out of the uh, camera to yawn. To yawn. So the, they were very feminine. I feel like that showed that the movie was going towards a female audience. Feminine. But <laughs> feminine. Feminine. Your phlegm is a, a phlegm name. of a girl. Ew. Feminine. <laughs> as opposed to masculine phlegm. Yes. I'm a feminist. <laughs> Feminist. <laughs> I won't put your last name in there, don't worry. Matt, are you pro-feminism? I'm pro-feminism. I'm pro-feminism. <laughs> Alright, so we have the three main actors and actresses in the movie. So we have Shailene Woodley, Woo! who I think was the perfect Hazel. Oh, she I don't was think so they could have good. Been she was perfect. She, she was, was beautiful. Such. She was such. She was such. Insert dote. And then we have Augustus Waters as Ansel Elgort. Ansel Elgort as Augustus Waters. JK. Words are hard. <laughs> and he was a beautiful person. He was. He was so good. I, I, the egg throwing scene uh, with him and it was beautiful. Uh, that was perfect. <laughs> like, when we saw the, like... Um, the preview scenes that they showed to us. They showed the one with the cigarette and then they showed that one. I felt really awkward watching them and it made me a little scared because I felt like I was sitting in on their personal lives mm -hmm. and I shouldn't have been doing that. But when the whole movie came together, it came together like, perfectly. It did. It <laughs> and was I just, awesome. It felt like I was just sitting there and watching their lives fall apart. Also, Nat Wolf yes. as Isaac is oh, hilarious. Naked Brothers Band. Bringing it back. He's perfect, Crazy and he's gonna car. be Q in Paper Towns, but like in the trophy scene, I I couldn't control myself. Oh my god, so funny! <laughs> like they're trying to have their own conversation, and they they can't. Like no offense, Ansel and Shailene, you're doing a great job, yeah. but Nat is just so much better. Nat stole that scene. It was perfect. And then Hazel's parents. We may or may not have recorded the whole video. And then we lost it like four minutes into it. You missed really good stuff. You missed stuff about... Ice Cream Holocaust the, the movie. Yeah, you'll never find out the greatness <laughs> of Ice Cream Holocaust the movie. But did we even talk about After Hazel's Parents? Um, six stars. Six stars, yes. It got five out of six stars from me. And five out of six from me. Or five point five out of six. Yeah. And it was very good book to movie. Book to movie. Very good. The uh, Anne Frank scene ripped me to shreds. Oh, that was so good. Anne Frank voiceover person, please call me and read me that story. <laughs> because I like it. Actually, Ice Cream Holocaust likes it, but I'm so sure does it's Ener. sad. Yeah, Ener likes it. <laughs> <laughs> Ener likes Ice Cream Holocaust, the movie. I bet. Ener is the reason because of the ice cream holocaust. Probably. 
She was probably buddies with Ice Cream Hitler. She gave it six out of six stars. <laughs> we talked about the egg scene. The egg scene was very good. Oh, I did. I like the egg scene in the best, scene was I think. Very good. I'm sorry, so much movie. Such movie. So little sleep. Oh, you said, you said Peter Van Houten. Oh, I did. <laughs> Lita Vi. <laughs> Later bye. Later bye. This is Peter. Later bye. I wonder if Chloe ever called me back. Chloe. Chloe is Marie's friend who My keeps stalker. texting her, and she thinks that Marie called her. I didn't. Yeah. But then I called her for real, <laughs> and I left her a pretty little voicemail. Later bye. In my best Swedish accent. Yes, Matt. I ship you and Later bye, and I'm gonna start a Tumblr shipping it. Um, our old sixth grade teacher asked about you today, so I hope your day is going wonderfully, and I hope you bend all the elements and destroy the fire nation. Um, I love you. Be good. I think we're still recording. Goodbye! 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 Goodbye!